and gentlemen, it's time to put your gum shields in. 20. has gone, Cracker has gone, Shim has gone, Green Slade has gone. Trying to see and it is a very, very quick rolling lap this time and they are immediately underway. And Sam Murdy wastes no time, he's shoving Scott in the fence. It's a little bit more subdued out of the way to skills long to Timmy Barnes. Burning out the order, Dino winds out 128, he's created 386, and the defending champion again has been dumped out this time by Picton. Oh, 131, all or nothing on skills, puts him in the fence. Hugely aggressive move as Stotty dumps out Samson, he is collected by 641. And it's Sam Manny who's emerged in the lead. 181, the new leader. Timmy Barnes in second, Michael Allen in third, Barnes, he's like a pit bull. He won't give up at this time, he goes into a half spin. And the leaders are now neck and neck. And Skills dumps Barnes out the home straight. Now it's Waterfield to the front in 360. Stotty, Farlow Jr. There's more than covers. Parker dumps out Mano. And Skills into the blocks. And then Sparker goes out as well. Absolute mayhem. Stotty now lunges at Waterfield to try to take the lead. It's Farlow Jr. who takes it up. Got a red flag again. But it's lap sheer order this time because we've done three laps, thank God. We have a red flag again. And I'm assuming it is for Carl Warfield. Oh, Max Scott is in control of this. And he pulls the trigger about a third of the way down the back straight. We're away racing. Dino wastes no time with lunge on 2-2-0 pacing, which is good for 
this segment goes behind him, Peppers puts 306 into the fence, the 124 skills does the exact same with triple seven Ainsley, and you get a feeling that maybe, maybe they're just getting started, it's 157, Scott Uli, 730, Dino in second, 2-5, Milo Jr. in third, 217, Madrid in four. 4 to 8 Samson, 386 Patters and 349 Allah. That is the order as the Saloons come through. 157 Snyder leader and now I say track and this is going to get very, very interesting now on this glorious hot afternoon. And of course, all these stoppages and track is drying out as 538 Swanny Jr. lunges 306 and then 124 skills he moves in to a 538 defence and 128 gets to take going. Meanwhile, it's 220. Casey Anderson up the inside for the lead and behind Samson all or nothing on Magic with Dino. It's going to be good for second. As Dino Barth probably sinks on Ross for a little bit of pace. Marley and Daniel Pears are back straight spinners. And he's 4 to 8 now. Samson up front. 2 2 0. He lost. Max stop. He gets spat out. As Dino locks the two drivers, spins himself. Dino has gone. And Scoyles Jr. is an ex high profile casualty. He is dumped out by Barry Russell. Lee Samson leads. Casey Anderson second is 306, Black 730, and around he goes. Allard is third, Madrick is four, Russell is now fifth. 733, 306. Alan Ainsley, Banwell with skills, crashing down the back straight, but it's 428. Lee Sampson the leader, 220 in second, 349 in third, it's 124 now, skills with a big dive on Banwell. And the race race through, Dean Mays finally gets himself back into the running. Daniel Petters still stricken down here on the exit in turn four, but he's got power in the car. It'll be halfway next time as Madrid barges past the back marking band while but Samson is now not only leading, but he's got a little bit of an advantage. He's won this one before. Can he regain the title this afternoon? Philo Jr. in second, Allard in third, Madrid in fourth, Barry Russell in fifth, I think it's Daniel Parker in sixth. Carl Pitton is seven. There's a rest. Race their way through. Solomon Van Eyre Bowl on the inside of Daniel Parker to gain another position. But it's Lee Sampson who leads. He's on the back straight. Swanny Junior sends Scotty spinning. And do they come with some of our laps left in this national championship for the National Bangers? And Skillsy fired up and taken out of the second place. Man, Philo Junior has gone. Allard goes second. And Lee Sampson now enjoys an even more comfortable advantage. Allard even second place under pressure from Skills. It's 207 Madrick in third. 600 Russell in fourth. 306 Parker in fifth. 733 Hitton. The next for showing him 641 Scoils. And it's back for Lee Sampson. 428 your leader. It's 217 Madrick makes contact with 349 Allard. Moves in wide coming up to turn four. That's the race for second. And Lee Sampson now in amongst the back half of traffic, trying to work his way through against his right inside of Dean Mays. You almost feel gave him a little bit of breathing room now. Swanee Jr. puts two slow Philo Jr. into the fence as Scotty and Mallet trip over one another. 217 and Madwick into second position as 181 Mallet with a lunge to Dino to force him wide. Scotty another one to fall by the wayside. And 538 Swanny Jr. having a nibble at the 220 car, Casey Enderson. And spins him around this time on the home straight. It is five laps to go. Next time around, five to go. And Lee Sampson is almost half a lap clear. Well on course for a second national title victory. 2177 race for 30, up between Allard and Russell. With Daniel Parker, the next to show. The rest are racing their way through. As a Willie Schools Jr. gets stuck in the car, Picton. But it's 4 to 8 Lee Sands and the track conditions changing all the time. These slick conditions in this searing heat. And of course, this race has been stopped three times now. But it is Samson who leads another lap closer to a second national title. Barry Russell has gone third. Allard struggling, I think, in these slick conditions. Lee Sampson coming through. He's got two to run. Comfortably clear the race for second, though. Could go to the wire. Madwick and Russell scrapping it out. 
four to eight, Lee Sands on the inside of two to eight, Casey Engelston. And Russ having a sniff for the rear bumper of Gary Madwick. That is the main race. And Russell now on the inside of Madwick for second. Meanwhile, down the back straight for the final time. He last won this in 2017. He takes it back in 2016. Lee Sampson is a two-time national champion of the last lap. 217 and 349, both large and 600 Russell. And on the line, I think Arrow by a bumper. Beats Barry Russell across the line. Swanee Jr. spins around Casey Anderson. We've got him, Thomas. Red flag, please. To end the action pack. A little bit of controversy there as well, but there's so much going on. And it eventually comes to a conclusion. The celebration start on the pitch turn. And we have a new Saloon Stockholm National Champion winning the event for the second time. Well done to 428. He's Lee Sampson.